Hey guys, another video from SEO and webdesign.com. Uh, we're gonna learn about context. It's uh, one of my favorite modules. You can just go to Drupal and type context inside, and you come here. and I'm using Drupal 7. You can read about here, and you just download the la latest development version and drop it uh, or you, with. Uh, with Drupal 7 you can just copy the link and just uh, under install new modules that just paste the link and it's gonna install uh, the Drupal is gonna install the module on the fly you don't have to upload or anything so <coughs> here's how, how I'm using the context you go on the structure context context is basically you can do a lot of stuff with it uh, for example let's let's just check it i have uh for example i'm displaying some online uh overlay forms like with color box where you display content content on top like for example in this uh in this uh like this like an admin menu is overlaid and <clears throat> with context i set up my website every time that the context spot something in my URL like uh, web form or or spot the type of the content it's gonna switch the it's gonna switch the oh, Windows has detected that your computer's performance is slow I'm using the I have the best laptop out there <laughs> and it's still slow I cannot believe but okay so uh, I set up the context to switch my theme when I'm opening a new type of content for example web forms I set uh, okay here I set up the context uh, for overlay forms let's go check it out here I say uh, you input the name and then there are conditions uh, I set the condition. There are many conditions. You can set up menu, menu type, menu item, taxonomy term, uh, side wide context, uh, user role, user page, etc. So we have a node type already selected, and I check the every time the uh, the content is web form. This context context will switch the theme. And then there's also a path, but here is the trick. I said the require all conditions, so both these conditions needs to be valid. So the context, so we're gonna get the reaction from the context, like the path, because the contact us is also a web form, and here you can set to exclude this contact us page by using the tilde in front of the path URL path so basically the context will work for all the node types for the web form but it will exclude the contact us which is also web form page and has a little bit tilde in, in front of the URL so this is how you do it if you want to exclude any page you just put a small tilt tilde in front of the URL and then you have the reaction and I'm using like a Delta theme and Omega theme where you can quickly with Delta you can I'm gonna talk in, um, about it in another video you should check it out and here you can uh, add many reactions what I did is I set the Delta and check and when this context is valid then the the context will enable a new custom theme that's called Delta Omega Reno overlay and it's not gonna use the default Omega theme it's gonna use the Delta theme so you have other reactions here you can you can choose blocks add add different blocks if that context is valid uh, menus I haven't tried this but uh, class is click class. You can do some CSS regions. You can disable regions. For example, like I'm doing, you can 
if you have like an overlay page for example you you should disable the header and footer so only the con the main content will show up so here you can sh disable different regions disable the following oh in in omega reno theme you can disable page top page bottom and enable and leave the content enabled and disable all the header menu footer whatever you want so when you when your theme when the context is valid you can uh, disable some of the parts of your website uh, and then there's a uh, theme other stuff you can do with context but this is I use it predominantly for switching my theme and I'm gonna talk about Omega and uh, Delta theme on another page in another video so I shouldn't save this because this context is already working I'm just gonna turn it off oops I just show a little bit of the website but it's okay uh, nothing nothing to worry uh, so here is context really good it works well with uh, uh, with Omega theme with other modules how you install it uh, nothing really special you just go under here is uh, the modules page, page and here you have to enable all three you have to enable context, context layouts and context UI and this is how the context works it's like really an amazing model, it's one of my favorite. And that's it. Peace and love. See you.